What's up, YouTube people? You guys are so back again for another video meant to do. Got video uploaded by Cosmic Wonder. This is apparently a Spider-Man No Way Home new trailer daily bugle TV spots. It's about a minute long, so we're gonna check this out. And then we're gonna check out his most recent video, which he posted after this, including which is gonna talk about some new Spider-Man No Way Home footage. So, two for one special from Cosmic Wonder. Let's get it, man. Let's go. But before we get into it, y'all, let me know down below in the comments how was your day. Hopefully, it was pretty good. If it wasn't, hopefully, this makes it just a little bit better. Let's get it, man. Let's go. Hey, TikTok. We have a major story TikTok, developing in good New York gosh. right now. We've been experiencing some wildly unseasonable weather in the Big Apple lately, and there really? has to be more to this. I've experienced some intense thunderstorms in NYC before, but crazy lightning wasn't uh, on this week's I weather report. <laughs> Last time I checked, the nearest desert wasn't close enough to cause a sandstorm in Midtown. I, I see what she's Does doing. Does this mean supervillains are back? Hold on one second, I'm getting word from the studio. Yes, no. Yes, sir. Um, J. No, Jonah? Sir. J no Jameson? My name, I'm Betty Brandt. Betty Brandt. Yes, you can call me worst intern ever. That's, that's <laughs> cool. Okay. She's not Breaking the same. News, she's not as good as Betty. From uh, According Sam to Rainey. my boss, J. Jonah Jameson, these crazy weather events are the work of the spider, spider menace. menace. <laughs> trying to make it look like supervillains are to blame. You heard it here first on the Daily Bugle. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So look, anyway, this video is coming up right here. So that was interesting. Um, Daily Bugle, little TV spot slash clip, I guess. I wonder if that's actually going to be in the movie. Or is it just like a... Advertising thing. I've seen ha uh, YouTube in their double ass, bro. I swear. That's why I'm helping protect myself against some kid. What's going on, everybody? All right. Warren, welcome back to the Cosmic Wonder, where we talk all things Marvel and MCU, and we have some yes, new Spider-Man footage to go over today, and really, really important dialogue from this new footage. In fact, this new dialogue could prove that Marvel Studios and Sony are really altering their trailer footage from what the movie could actually be. Marvel Studios well, is known for that. doing this, and it would make sense that they would do it for Spider-Man No Way Home, even though it is Sony. They're still right. being extremely secretive about this movie we still haven't heard anything about toby Maguire's spider-man or andrew garfield spider-man even you guys saw that thing on marvel contest of champions if you know you know so they have showed us all of the villains from the other universes and right. in this video i'll talk about just how hard marvel studios and sony are trying to keep toby and andrew a secret until people actually see the film of course so to talk about today but first big congratulations is the video kind of low to you guys i think it's lower than normal our spider-man collectible giveaway ah shout out to him Collect. I'm going to be doing a massive giveaway, and I'm going to announce this about mid next week. There is going to be a ton of opportunities to win a lot of really cool stuff. So be sure to subscribe and hit the bell so you don't miss out on that announcement. Now we actually have two new trailer TV spots to break down, both with right. some new footage, but it's really the dialogue that I want to talk about because I think the dialogue actually reveals a lot. And let's talk about this first one that has new dialogue from. James oh, I haven't Fox. seen this one. What's happening? Visitors from every universe over here. That sounded choppy. <laughs> Multiverse is real. My old friend so Spider-Man. Most people would spot out what the big thing here is. is he references Spider-Man. My old friend Spider-Man. As in he's spot and this him happens before. right after Doctor right. Strange says, visitors from every universe are here. And as I hear Doctor Strange say this more and more in each TV spot and trailer that we get, I definitely don't think he's talking about every single universe. I actually think he's talking about every Spider-Man universe. And only hmm. dealing with actually a few universes. Because we know these villains come from actually just two other universes. Is Toby yeah. Maguire's universe and Andrew Garfield's universe. That's a but good the point. The dialogue here is what Electro says, my old friend Spider Man. Now, right off the bat, you wonder who exactly he's talking to. And of course, there are only two options. One is oh. he's actually talking to Andrew Garfield. I didn't even think about that. <laughs> of course, who he went up against. Could be talking to Andrew. Yeah. Too. Now, if he saw Andrew Garfield without the mask on, he would obviously recognize who he is. In fact, we right. know that this is confirmed to be true because in the trailer where Doc Ock sees our Spider-Man without his mask on and he realizes recognizes. that it's Tom Holland's Spider-Man right. and not Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man. He says, 
you are not Peter. So right. it's been established that these villains from other universes, when they get into our universe, the main MCU timeline, they do see a clear difference in the Spider-Man that they see, without the mask right. on at least. But if they see him with the mask on, they can still tell that there's a slight difference, but don't necessarily think that it's a different Spider-Man. This gotcha. is also demonstrated where Doc, Doc Ock says Doc. in a trailer yeah. and TV you think spots, your new fancy, your fancy new suit yeah. isn't going to help you. Doc yeah. Ock recognizes that it's not the same Spider-Man suit that he thought Toby was wearing. His mm. first initial thought was that it wasn't a different Spider-Man, but it was Toby wearing a different suit. But the main point being, he could tell a difference. So right. again, we have two choices. Jamie Foxx's Electro is talking to Andrew Garfield's Spider-Man, or he is talking to, of course, Tom Holland's Tom Spider-Man. And it is very possible that we could get a scene with Electro and Tom Holland's Spider-Man that is very similar to the one that we get with Doc Ock. Jimmy Fox Correct. is Electro, sees Spider-Man, he thinks it's Andrew Garfield Spider-Man, seeks out revenge and goes to fight him. And then, of course, he would realize that it's actually not the same Wait, Spider-Man. you're not the, the tall, deal. winky kid. We do know that Andrew Garfield will be in the film, and we do know there is going to be a rematch, rematch. between Electro and Andrew Garfield Spider-Man. So this could literally be dialogue from that rematch. It could be point. from right before these two go into battle against one another. And if it is, that's pretty dang cool. Heck yeah. Now, we do have another TV spot, and I'm actually very, very curious about the dialogue in this one, and I think you will be too. Check this out. All right. Spider-Man is in fact Peter Parker. My entire life got screwed up. Could you make it so that Mysterio never revealed my identity? Sounds super choppy again. What just happened? Shut that spell down. We started getting visitors. Looks like we got competition. Ooh, I like that. I promise I'll fix this. Exclusively in movie theaters, December 17th. You said when I shut that spell down? shows something to me that is very audios. clear here that isn't so clear in the other trailers. In the official teaser in the main trailer, Doctor Strange says the whole world is about to forget that Peter Parker is Spider-Man. But in this TV spot, it seems very clear what Peter is asking Strange to do. He says, can you make it to where Mysterio never revealed my identity? Oh. This is very, very different oh. than what Doctor Strange is going to do in his spell. And this is why Peter what? actually oh, kind of that? has Doctor Strange says botches the spell because it's not what he asked for but here's some extremely interesting new important dialogue dr strange says that he stopped the spell he specifically says in this tv spot when i shut that spell down yeah started getting visitors from the other universes so marvel's doing it man they're they're doing this whole hiding the truth type of thing like they do oh man this is interesting here dr strange doesn't say that spider-man botched it he says that he shut it down and this is most likely due to spider-man during the spell saying hey dude this isn't the right spell that you're doing peter goes into the sanctum looking for dr strange to erase what mysterio did not right. to make everyone forget that he's spider-man but to make it to where the event where mysterio revealed his identity hmm. didn't really sony slash marvel very, you very six scoundrels and spider-man Man, Peter Parker realizes this as Doctor Strange is doing the spell. He doesn't want everyone to forget that. I can't wait to, to support a strong immune system. Your body. I can't wait to see this movie, man. I'm so glad I got my tickets. So glad. Friday night. That he's Spider-Man because that would be very, very problematic. Of Think course. About it. People like Happy Hogan, Pepper Potts, Wong. Falcon, all of the other Avengers, all of the people that participated in Avengers Endgame, and of course... That's a cool scene. I like that MJ, with Doc Ock Aunt May, and Ned, Cars. None of them would know that he is Spider-Man. And that right. would essentially erase all of those moments. Peter would remember, but nobody else would. So yeah. Peter would remember, but that's it. And that means that he wouldn't have help from anybody, which may actually be somewhat of the point of Spider-Man No Way Home. That's something fans I think have been so. wanting to see for a while. Peter on his on own. But it does seem very clear that people still do know that Peter Parker is Spider-Man. MJ and Ned are with him, it looks like, throughout the entire movie. So this makes me yep. believe one of two things. And one thing is, I think some of these TV spots are definitely edited to make us believe certain things. Right. Whether that's the ordering of some words, the phrasing, or whether that's simply putting things in here that aren't exactly going to be in the real movie. And we have now officially seen that with this TV spot. Dr. Strange says two different lines. One, right. when you botch that spell 
but now in this TV spot, he says he well, I shut, shut it down. that spell. So down. it looks like one of these two lines is fake, and Marvel put it in the trailer to throw us off. Ah. Again, Marvel kind of does that for every trailer that they have. Yeah. And you can't be There's a couple times that, I can think of. So things remain a surprise to us. Yeah. And we've already seen proof that they are doing this. Remember Lizard, <laughs> the invisible ghost kicking, kicking. him in the face, yeah. <laughs> which we know is actually Andrew Garfield or Toby Maguire. What? And get this. There's a press screening today, and according to some insiders like a Big press Screen screening? Leaks, they're only going to be shown the first 45 minutes of the film. Oh. The reason that everybody is saying they're only going to get shown the first 45 minutes is... I'm assuming the first 45 minutes don't include Tom and Toby, that's why. I mean, Toby and Andrew. So it's not quote-unquote confirmed, I guess, you know. As Sony doesn't want them to see the other Spider-Man. That's... They don't I, want them to see them on screen and go spoil come on now. for everybody else. Exactly. Well, we all pretty much know, but let's face it, there is that part in everybody that's like, until I see it, until somebody tells me... Oh, I don't believe it. it yeah. Released, it's not 100%. It's 99.99999%, yeah. but not 100 And Sony right. is really trying to keep that a secret until you actually see, see it on movie. screen, which Dude, I, I can't appreciate. Can't but wait. now the real question is what exactly is going to happen two in weeks man two no way home. weeks and luckily we don't have that much longer to wait just a couple of weeks now and i know everybody's excited so oh, yeah. let me know how excited you are in the comments down below don't forget to like the video and let me know what you think about it of course for live updates you can follow me on instagram and twitter and as always thank you all so much for watching wolf wolf, wolf. wolf. all right cosmic wonder here set a man here um yeah so we had a new daily beagle uh, TV spot slash a little bit of a trailer there. It was really entertaining and interesting. I like what they did there with the whole elements of the uh, of uh, or of like you know natural occurrences like thunder and um, <gasps> excuse me, Sandman and the storms and the sand everywhere and stuff. That was real cool and interesting. You know what I'm saying? I wonder if that's actually going to be in the movie. This, however, very interesting. Marvel does do that though. They like change up lines and scenes and uh, add stuff and put fake scenes in to like kind of throw people off so now seeing this like this is so bluntly like blankly like this just makes you think like hmm what else from the trailer is probably real or not real or edited i mean there's a couple scenes we're aware of that i'm aware of at least i'm like 100 sure yeah that's edited you know what i'm saying but i wonder like, what like what lines and stuff you know what i'm saying because the trailers have like a lot of big lines from it you know what i'm saying that everyone's like quoting or saying now so Looks like we got competition. I hope that's in there. I really do. <laughs> that's, I like it's a good line from Doc Ogg. But anyways, y'all let me know down below in the comments. What are your thoughts on this? Make sure you go over to Cosmic Wonder page. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Man, we're only two weeks away from watching this movie. I definitely can't wait. Definitely make sure. If you haven't already, you got your tickets because uh, they're going just like that. With that being said, make sure you follow me on Twitch, YouTube. You can also follow me on Instagram at Leroy Set. So same as YouTube channel. They can also send me to our That means said peace.